Hey everyone, today we are going to solve the read code question length of last word. Okay, so let me explain with this example, hello world. And let me put asterisk instead of space so that you can see space easily, right? And uh, for this question, we have to return length of last word, in this case, world. So that's why it's obvious uh, we should iterate through from the end so that we can solve this question easily. And uh, next, uh, let's count the index number. So 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 5 is space, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, and 11, 11 also space. And then um, we try to find the start point, uh, start point of last word and the end point of last word. So uh, from uh, we iterate through from the end, so we try to find the end position at first. So we create an end pointer and now uh, end pointer is 11. And uh, if um, current character is space, uh, we should move end pointer to next because space is not last word, right? Part of last word, right? So that's why uh, in this case, we should move next. And then we find D. So this is not space. So that's why uh, we should stop iteration. So now uh, we successfully um, find the end point of last word, so index 10. And then next, let's try to find the start point of last word. So first of all, we copy end pointer to start pointer. So start pointer start from index 10. And uh, this in this case, uh, we try to find uh, um, space. So that means um, if current character is not space, in the case, uh, we should move start pointer to next. And then now uh, we find D, so that's why we should move start pointer to next, and then next L, and we should move start pointer to next, and we find R, and this is not space, so that's why move start pointer to next, and we find O, and uh, no space, so that's why move next, and we find W, and uh, no space, so that's why move next. And then now we find the space, right? So that's why uh, we stop iteration. And then all we have to do is just end minus start. So that means 10 minus 5 equals 5. So length of last word is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. And we get 5, right? So looks good. That is a basic idea to solve this question. So let's jump into the code. Okay, so let's write the code. First of all, create an end pointer initialized with uh, last index, so s minus 1. And then, uh, um, first of all, uh, let's try to find the end pointer, end point of the last word. So while s and end equal space, so in that case, uh, we should move end pointer to next. So in this case, minus equal one, right? And then after that, so let's try to find the start point of a last word. So first of all, copy, so start equal end. And then while start is greater than or equal zero, end, that character is not equal um, space. So in that case, um, we move start pointer to next, right? And then after that, all we have to do is just end minus start. Yeah, so let me submit it. Yeah, looks good. And the time complexity of this solution should be order of n where n is a uh, length of input string. And the space complexity is O1. We don't use an extra data structure, so that's why. OK, so let's try a coding exercise. OK, so what if we have to iterate through from the beginning, I mean, from index 0? How do you write a solution? So this is uh, one of our examples, so let's try. 
So first of all, create a length initialized with zero. So this is a return value. So this is a length of each word. And then let's say um, counting. So this is a flag and the first of all false. So if counting is true, in the case we are counting length of current word. So I'll, I'll show you how to use counting. And then let's iterate through one by one for character in string. And if current character is not equal space, so that means um, so we find a new word. And then if not counting, so currently if not counting, in that case, we should start a new counting. So that's why uh, counting should be uh, true. And then length uh, always start one, right? And then else, so that means uh, we find uh, some character, but uh, uh, actually we already counting, we start counting. In that case, we should add plus one to length, right? Because now we are counting. And then, so if, oops, uh, we find the space, in the case, um, so that is the end of current word. So try to find a new word uh, in like a later index. So that's why we should uh, update flag, so counting um, with false. So that we can start new counting here when we find uh, some character. And then after that, uh, we should return ranks. I think uh, uh, this works. So let me submit it. Yeah, it looks good. And the uh, time and the space is the same as uh, solution one. I think the time is on and the space is O1. Okay, so this is uh, just idea. I think you cannot use uh, this idea in real interview, but uh, we can solve this question like this. So return length of last word. So s dot split and then minus one. So this should be like, um, like a hello and a world. And uh, all we have to do is just return length of world, right? So that's why we put the minus one here. And then just return length of last word. Yeah, so let me submit it. Yeah, it looks good. So this is a faster than the first two solution. Run time is beat 62%. Yeah, and as I told you, I think uh, you cannot use this idea in real interview. So if you feel bored, uh, you can suggest this solution to the interviewer. Yeah, so that's all I have for you today. Please support me with the actions such as comment and the hitting like button. I'll see you in the next question.